Hey there, you filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back with another episode of the GTM Show. And back again with... John B. In the house. Today we're going to be doing something from the frozen food department again. Uh, we're not going to be doing burgers or chicken sandwiches or any kind of stuff like that. Uh, we're going to be doing something kind of pizza roll-like. You like pizza rolls? The last time I had some... I had a cheesecake roll. A cheesecake roll? Yeah. Came out of the oven. It came out of a restaurant. And it was hot? It was hot, had the cheesecake, you know, it looked like a, um, an egg roll with cheesecakes. Um, Damn, hot cheesecake. I'm thinking, no, not cheesecake, I'm sorry. Cheesesteak. Oh, thank cheese God. Steak. Thank cheese God. Steak. Cheese that steak. sounds a lot better. I can get down with that. I'd try that one time. Yeah, I don't think you want to try that. No? Not from where I got it. All right, someplace different then. Maybe if Totino's made it. No, nah, it was at um, it was at Dave and Dave and Buster's. That says a lot right there. Yeah. It's like a uh, Chuck E. Cheese for adults. Mm -hmm. Go karts and. Oh yeah. So um, here we go. If you went to an Italian restaurant to have dinner, Don P, what would you order? What's your favorite? Oh, you know, food? you know that. The chicken parmesan. That's what I figured. That's the only thing I get, man. So what if they made uh, pizza rolls and put chicken parmesan inside the pizza roll? It looks friggin' awesome. So there you go. All my stoners out there. Just for me. Chicken parmesan. They know. Totino's pizza rolls. Thank you. If, it, if this comes out to be anywhere near what I love chicken parmesan to be, you sign me up. Sign me up. I'm gonna have like two or three bags of this in my in, in my own freezer. So we got uh, oven instructions and microwave instructions on the back, and I think only a fucking sucker would put this in the microwave. Oh yeah, it could be soggy as hell. I would never put any kind of uh, pizza roll of any type, any brand, anything into the microwave. Either looking for rubber or soggy. Yeah, something like this is always going to have to be done in the oven, and if you microwave it you're just shortchanging yourself right off the bat better think rethink your approach so we have already preheated our oven to 425 degrees we're going to throw some of these in there for 11 minutes we'll be right back after a jump cut okay see what we got all right all right you filthy animals it's been 11 minutes uh these are sat out and cooled while we got straight blazed and now it's time to give these a try see what we got some of them have already busted open as usual we see that's pretty typical with uh, pizza rolls. So Not crunchy like I thought it would be. Yeah, no, these are pretty soft actually. They didn't get too crispy in there. It's like a like the egg roll pasta. If you want it really um, crispy, you have to deep fry them. Yeah, it feels like a um, like an egg roll or a ravioli type texture. That's what it smells like too. It doesn't really smell like chicken parmesan. It's uh, a little bit like a chef Boyardee. There so we go. You like it that much? No, nah, not really digging that. That's chicken parmesan. It's rancid. That might be why we got to pick these up on clearance. If they stuck with pizza bites, yeah. This cheap, cheap marinara sauce is just killing this. This is horrible. Yeah, it's coming off actually tasting like it's uh, rancid or sour. It's doughy. Got like some off-brand raviolis. From a dented can sale. I don't taste any chicken. I don't, I don't know if I bite, bit into any chicken. Yeah, the chew wasn't there. And you can see little white pieces. I'm assuming that's the pasta. Little white pieces of meat hanging out there. That's supposed to be the chicken meat. That's chicken? It's supposed to be the chicken. Mmm. And maybe uh, that's why I was full. Yeah, no. Those are just blending right in. You don't even, like, with the chew. And this outside shell, everything's so doughy, it all just kind of mushes together, and you mm -hmm. don't really know what's what. Yeah, all the texture's the same. There's no flavoring. This has no, no resemblance of chicken palm. And I'm a chicken palm expert. As far as tasting. Nah. No. I'm not digging that at no, all. No, that's, that's, oh my it's God. cheap. Yeah. Two out of five. Yeah, it's not, 
horrendous. I've we've we've tasted worse, so I'm gonna have to agree with you on the two out of five. I I personally don't ever want to see these again. No, I never want to see these. It's a half ass attempt. Mm -hmm. All right, so there you have it. Uh, chicken parmesan. We're not gonna say they're not pizza. Those are the chicken parmesan rolls from Totino's. Mm -hmm. um, we got them as clearance, so maybe they're discontinued. Who knows? Uh, there might be a damn good reason for that. Yeah. So if you want to leave us a comment, if you've had these, maybe you like them. Uh, maybe you're sad that they're going away. Uh, just leave us a comment at Twitter at the Real Mr. Dirty. And until uh, next time, I'm Mr. Dirty. I'm Big GTM Show. Go have a rotten day. to the pit bull next door. Mm -hmm.